Yeah, I would say it came together fairly quickly. Nashville were, uh, you know, very clear in their intent on signing Walker and showed how much they valued him and, and presented a significant offer for him. And while these aren't easy decisions to make, I think, um, you know, Na Nashville and its credit to Walker and uh, what he has done here, not just not just here for the two years, but also throughout his career, that he is so highly highly valued, and and we had to make, um, you know, this tough decision to to trade him. What about Walker uh, as as a person um, and as a personality in the locker room? We obviously we can talk about him on the pitch, but he was you talk about having players that are good guys. Um, he seemed like one of those guys. How do you replace that? Yeah, our philosophy whenever we bring a player in is man first, player second, and and Walker is certainly a testament to that. It's ironic that when we were coming in as an expansion team, we saw Walker as such a key piece and uh, to acquire from Dallas at that time two years ago, and and now Nashville's in in the same boat. But yeah, Walker. Walker, his wife, they've been an integral part of the LAFC family and our history. They've helped us lay this foundation that we hope we'll, we will build upon in the years to come. But, you know, Walker will always be remembered for the role he's played here for these two years. Exactly a week out from your Champions League up and era. Was that any cause for concern with making a deal this close? And does that speak more to your guys' confidence in the other pieces you have here? Or did it speak more to just kind of the, the quality of Nashville's offer when it came to how it worked out? Uh, I would say a combination of all those factors. Obviously, for for Nashville, it's it's an urgent need for them, which they made they made very clear. So we can't always just do things on our our timeline. You know, Walker has been away this preseason with with the national team, and he's played um, in those games games for them. And we've been uh, moving on with our preseason, so it's also our willingness to make this move is not just a function of the the offer and, and the proceeds and the opportunities now that we will have to strengthen the roster in certain ways, but it's also the confidence of the guys that we do have here. Obviously, Walker's been a huge piece. He started the vast majority of our games, and now that'll give opportunities to the guys that we have here and also um, give us the opportunity to strengthen if the, if the right opportunities present themselves. Yeah, I think you guys are kind of known for not necessarily going right up against the salary cap. You guys have been pretty aggressive in spending and using all the resources you possibly can. How attractive is it to have this flexibility now um, to, to kind of strengthen that team like you're talking about? I would push back slightly on that. I think we, we do spend, but we have managed our cap and our discretionary spend in such a way that we've always enabled ourselves flexibility to make moves. Obviously with the additions that we had in this window, um, we, we were getting to a point where we were tighter on the, on the cap, but we're able to bring in the pieces that we wanted, you know, most recently with, with Bradley Wright Phillips, which we're, all of whom we're, we're really excited about, but certainly, you know, the, this is the biggest deal for a defender in our league's history. And I would say rightfully so. He's been a big piece of, of what, what we have done, um, which we certainly appreciate, and I trust he will do the same in Nashville, which is why he has um, garnered this level of interest. Sí. Eh, si lo que quiero decir en, en, normalmente en uno, uh, alguien en mi posición dice que oh, es, es parte de la negocio y, y todo eso para, para mí no solo es parte del negocio pero es personal también no podemos ignorarlo entonces fue difícil pero bueno Walker es un, ha sido un jugador muy importante en, uh, uh, ha sido un bueno, jugado un gran papel en, 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 el, en el cuento de, de LFC y en, en, como equipo, como organización. Algunas veces cuando eh, lo personal uh, y combina con, con el, el parte de los negocios, necesita tomar decisiones que no son fáciles, pero en este caso con lo que tenemos ya y también... Um, El, el dinero va a darnos la oportunidad de mejorar en uh, el, el plantel. ¿Van a buscar a alguien en su posición? Uh, quizá, vamos a ver. No, no es una 
necesidad urgente para nosotros, pero siempre estamos uh, haciendo nuestro plan de scouting y todo para darnos oportunidades porque sabemos que algo puede pasar, una, alguien que puede estar lesionado o alguien que necesitamos preparar para todo lo posible. ¿Qué significa para ustedes eh, una llave contra León y la importancia que se le va a dar a la Liga de Campeones de CONCACAF donde la MLS se ha, se ha quedado corta en ese sentido en esa competencia? Sí, hasta entonces no hemos tenido el éxito que queremos en, en este torneo, pero nuestro plan desde el inicio del club hace cinco años fue ser un, un club global y este es el próximo pa paso para nosotros y tenemos ganas de ganar todo. So it gives us an additional slot. So now every team starts with eight. We'll now have nine and gives us flexibility to either utilize it immediately or at some point in the window or in the summer window. So it's one unoccupied as of right now. Um, there are some, there are certain things pending that I can't, that we, we it's not 100% clear yet, but we hope to have it clear in the next two weeks. Right. Certainly by roster compliance, it will be clear. <laughs>